guys, I'm constantly being beeped and I'm yet to decipher what the beeps mean. It's a language of its own here in India. Your head is pounding. Yes. So you're calling for a rickshaw. Ah, okay. <laughs> I just arrived in India in Mumbai. Yeah. And um, I have three cameramen for filming. So I'm, I'm not sure why. I just, <laughs> so I'm just going to wave. Welcome India. Hot stuff. Bolo guys. I like this one. Nice pickup. Thanks, Mercedes. Just feeling a bit nervous about the whole thing right now. Just, you know, there have been quite a few last minute changes, and my one priority to you guys is not letting you down. So, um, I always want wherever I go in the world to be an opportunity for us to meet and that's what I'm hoping is going to happen over the next few days with the meet and greets in Mumbai and Bangalore and I cannot wait to see you guys. Oh, I'm pretty sure there are no lanes. Hustle and bustle. Things are happening. We are heading now to the first meet and greet here in Mumbai and I cannot wait to meet you guys. We're about to head to Phoenix Market City in Korla. It's a mall and I'm gonna see you guys. Oh my God. My Indian fans are some of my most loyal fans and so that's why I've flown to India to meet you guys and it has all been possible for only two reasons. That's two of my favorite brands, um, Mercedes AMG here in India. Big, big thanks to them. They're actually celebrating 25 years in India and Michelin tires. They're one of the leading tire manufacturers in the world and they've been around for a long, long time, 130 years manufacturing tires. So I'm with those two incredible brands and that's why I was able to make it to India. So a big, big shout out to them. Thank you very, very much. And I'm super excited to be able to meet you. Look at this. Okay, let's open the roof. The two sliding doors come back and now it's blue. Check this out. Wow, that's, that's cool. You know where to come. Oh, look, there are steering wheels. Random steer. Oh, look, look at all these front bumpers here. Excuse me? You work here? Who, who works here? Uh, can you ask him how much the brake lights cost? Which brake lights? The one on the end. Yeah. How much? 500. 500. 500 rupees. Rupees. Okay, thank you. <laughs> okay, so if you need some brake lights, you can get some for seven bucks in this area and some sick rims. I didn't ask how much the rims were. Here, yeah, anything here. You can get anything? Yes, ma'am. What else can you get? About car. Anything car related? Uh, we need to go there. Yeah, we need to go there. We need to do a whole new video along like that street. Gearbox. I want to see what they have. Like seats. Seats? Yes. Gearboxes? Yes. Really? Um, look, this every tire. part which you need. Tires, everything, huh? Yes, ma'am. Cool.
Okay, we're here. We're gonna do some Bollywood dancing on stage. <laughs> and I'm gonna get a lesson first before we go up because I think that's quite important. So how does it start? So, so, it, so basically, basically, your stomach is aching. Imagine your stomach is aching. So this is what you do. This. That's what you do when you stomach ache? Yeah. <laughs> that's what I do. <laughs> that, this is a I, I go like this. Oh, <laughs> not this. <laughs> So it's like my like in India, you know, okay. you do an over exaggerate. Okay. So, so it's like, oh my stomach is pain. Oh my stomach is pain. Oh my stomach is pain. And it's also pain. And it's also pain. Heart. 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 Heart is. So yeah. Heart is pounding. Yeah. Heart is pounding. <laughs> stomach so, hurts, but heart is pounding. Yeah. Right. What's this mean? So I tell you what. Another story. I've got a story. Story. Yeah. Yeah. So, so the story is. Yeah. The story Stomach pains. We're creating like a Bollywood story. Yeah, here, yeah. Okay, so the Bollywood story is your stomach aches. Yes. Okay, your head is pounding. Yes. So you're calling for a rickshaw. Ah. Okay, <laughs> your city Vajay is calling for a rickshaw. Oh, okay, crazy. and you still can't find the rickshaw. No rickshaw. No rickshaw. No rickshaw. No rickshaw. Oh. No rickshaw. Oh. So, so then you, so no rickshaw, so you have to still look for a rickshaw. Right, right. right. So look for the rickshaw. <laughs> look for the rickshaw. <laughs> look for the rickshaw. Yeah. So now you look for the rickshaw. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You still find find, find a find doctor. Come find, find a doctor. Yeah, right, right. So then suddenly after looking for the yeah, rickshaw, yeah. oh, you found a doctor. <laughs> so then, yay! Found a doctor. Yay! <laughs> found a doctor. doctor. Yay! yay. <laughs> so this is so easy. Okay. 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 Oh, you're 
quite, uh, it's a very good setup, I have to say. Yeah, it's very professional. Yeah. And it's, I know. Oh, it's awesome. <laughs> It's the oh, angel. The yeah, oh, that's perfect. Yeah. Bangalore! Woo! Bangalore is what they call the garden city. And um, I'm super impressed, like some awesome people here today, some awesome cars. <laughs> <laughs> Especially for That's you. It's crazy, man. Thank, Thank, you. Thank you so Thank much. You so Look much. at this. Logo on the front of the R8. That is awesome. Namaste. Wow. Namaste. And, uh, <laughs> Hello. Hi. 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 I just wanted to come say hi quickly. Are you guys coming later on? To yep. the Hammond Carbon yep. Grub? Yep. Yeah? Okay, perfect. So I'll see you guys there. Yeah. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to come say hi. Hello. How are you guys? Welcome, Welcome to Bangalore. All the phones out. <laughs> <laughs> hi. <laughs> Thank you very much. It's beautiful here. Yeah, it's so it's... green. There's so many trees. This is awesome. So these guys usually get together every Sunday and go for a bit of a ride. And they've organized all of this for me today. And I'm so humbled by that. That is so so incredible. I'm just loving my trip to India so far. Massive thank you to DND Media for helping to arrange this very professional meet. Shangri-La has put on an awesome event here as well. It's a great hotel, um, beautiful, overlooking the garden city. And as soon as I got here, I was like, it's really green. Why is that? So many trees. And they're like, yeah, it's called the Garden City. So that makes sense. We've got a beautiful hotel room on the 17th floor. It's just looking over all of these incredible trees. It's like the perfect car for uh, the streets of India. It's fast, you've got the sound of the engine, you've got the power, but you've also got the comfort and you've got a little bit more clearance than some of these other supercars around me right now. Driving on Michelin tires, same as what Lucy has, the Pilot Sport Cup 2, so they're ultra high performance tires. So I've got them for India, keep me safe. Super important to get the right tire, because it means the difference between you stopping in time and not stopping in time and also for a supercar it means ultra high performance it means that you're going to go faster around a track if you have the right tire and also the right pressure and everything like that because it's all about the grip right you can go faster if you have the best grip and that's what they work on guys i'm constantly being beeped and i'm yet to decipher what the beeps mean it's a language of its own here in india there's like a long i'm being beeped right so but i don't know what it means there's like one long beep and then there's like two short beeps and then there's like someone constantly beeping <laughs> so i need to spend some more time here to try and work out what all these beeps mean but they do mean it's a communication method for them on the road. Wow, there's just cement laying in the middle of the road. Cement. And a massive barrier that is stuck in the fast lane. 
<laughs> so, oh my god! You've got to keep your wits about you here, like something crazy. Uh, just having like a concrete barrier stuck in the middle of the fast lane is so dangerous. <laughs> There is a car driving the wrong way down this road. This is a highway. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, dude. Oh what my god, in down? the middle of the highway. No, I'm not letting all that smoke in. Oh my god. <laughs> what is this place? <laughs> wow. So is that mandatory every time you do a U-turn, you have to do burnout? here all the um, guys who risk their lives every day <laughs> on the roads of Bangalore yes thank you <laughs> I'm the curry to his rice <laughs> One picture. Mercedes-Benz came to India yeah. right before that we had our own luxury car okay. okay the car that was considered the epitome of luxury made in India yeah Okay, had a luxurious rear seat. Okay. And uh, sort of that's the car that we have for you here. Really? As a surprise. So I get something typically Indian, like Indian made, Indian loved. Yes, it was made in India. Uh, it was one of the most uh, luxurious cars, like I said, wow. a vehicle that was looked upon by a lot of people. And as what kind of era are we looking at? What? This is decade? a 1970. So like I said, it's older okay. than Mercedes-Benz existence okay, in India. Wow. It is a Hindustan Motors ambassador. Oh my God! Yes! This is exactly what I wanted! <laughs> you guys rock! Man, I dropped that hint like just like tiny bit like here. Thank you, sir. Hi 
okay, okay, it's all good, it's all good. <laughs> it's all good. It's all good.
they have such wonderful energy. Some energy, I love that. That's great. Back to the hotel. 